Hi, this is Mr. Angeli, and I'm going to go over the seventh grade course selection sheet. You should be using this course selection sheet to circle all the classes you're going to take for next year. That means this is for sixth graders that are going to be in seventh grade next year. Of course, we start off with ELAR, which is English Language Arts Reading. You choose regular or honors. And then for math, if you were in honors math this year, then you can take honors math next year. If you were not in honors math this year, then you need to sign up for regular math. Science, everyone takes the same science, M0733, and the same social studies, M0743, for Texas history. Now next year for PE credit, all seventh graders take a full year of PE or athletics. If you're interested in athletics, you must submit paperwork to the coaches and make sure you meet all the coaches' requirements, and then you can sign up for, P, or for athletics in place of PE. So athletics is a full year class also, and it gives you your PE credit. So either you're gonna be in athletics or PE, but for right now, everyone signs up for PE. So for girls, that's M0754F, and for the boys, it's M0754M. And then that leaves two elective choices. So in your first elective choice, you have down here under the full elective options, you can see where it says pick two. Now, all of these, if you're in band, orchestra, or choir, we will place you in the proper choir, band, orchestra, etc. For right now, you're just going to use the generic number. If you're taking band, it's M0772. Orchestra is M0791. Choir is M0462F for the girls and M062M for the boys. Okay? Some of our other full year elective options are Spanish 1A. Spanish 1A is a foreign language course that you can take in seventh grade. It's one half of the Spanish 1 class that's a high school credit. You take Spanish 1A as a 7th grader and 1B as an 8th grader, and that gives you credit for Spanish 1. Just remember that if you sign up for Spanish 1A as a 7th grader, you must take 1B as an 8th grader to get credit for Spanish 1. And then we have courses that are new. So you could take journalism, creative writing, you could take debate. If you took debate before, you can take debate 2. In seventh grade, you'll notice that we have several courses that are high school credits, okay? The principles of art, audio, video, and communication, the principles of computer science, those courses are, in, they go into our Kate classes. So, for example, principles of art and audio, video, and communication will lead into digital communications in the 24th century as an eighth grader. The principles of computer science will lead into robotics as an eighth grader. So in seventh grade, you can take principles of computer science and then robotics as an eighth grader. You can take principles of art, audio, video, and communication as a seventh grader, and then digital communications in the 21st century as an eighth grader, okay? If you've never taken art before, you'll have to sign up for the M0675EA Art 1 course. Otherwise, if you took art, last year as a sixth grader, then you can take M0295 Art 2. If you have any questions, please notify your counselor. We will give you an opportunity to do this during class and we will be coming out to the classroom to check to see that you have all your courses entered into Skyward. Remember, use this selection sheet and circle all your choices, have them written down so it's faster when you enter them into Skyward. Thank you very much.